all right what's up you guys I'm back again with another video and as you guys already know I'm going to be reviewing the Paul George 3 blue NASA colorway or is it the Apollo I've heard Apollo 13 I'm not exactly sure which I've played a little bit of basketball on this because it's not too dirty as you can see uh, these actually fit perfect since I went up half a size so I went 12 when I usually go 11 and a half in all my shoes uh, the materials are great everything about this is uh, really an amazing shoe the fit like I said it fits perfect it locks you down it doesn't feel too tight you know you're not gonna slide around in this shoe uh, the traction's amazing you can really feel it grip onto the floor you can feel that you're not gonna be sliding around at all uh, and uh, this isn't too much of a comprehensive review. I really don't know too much about basketball. I kind of just fuck around a little bit. That's it. I just fuck around a little bit. I try and I fail most of the time. So if you really want a good performance review, go to probably someone else. But the materials on this, I really love the material. I love uh, the feel of this synthetic leather on uh, the sides and on the tongue. Uh... The mesh is amazing. There's a little synthetic leather here on the toe and on both sides. The cushioning, I was surprised. This is probably one of the most comfortable shoes I have. This is probably like top three comfortable shoes I own. Uh, it looks amazing. All these colors look amazing. The blue is very vibrant. Uh, I do like the little eyelets having different colors on them. I like it, the patches patches on them, NASA, and then that patch. I'm not exactly sure what patch that is, but it looks full. Uh, it has the American flag on the right, and then the PG on the left. And uh, on the heel it says, don't tell me the sky's the limit when there are footprints on the moon. Uh, it has a little orange swoosh on the inside, and it also has 93552. Uh, on the insides, it's just regular insole with the NASA logo. Really, the shoe's amazing. I would recommend it to everyone. It's pretty affordable. You wouldn't be spending too much. And I guess that's really it for this shoe. But I was going to have another video come out before this one. Sadly, the shoe that I bought to review was fake got sent to StockX, which I bought it from, and they told me that it was fake, so I got refunded. I have another version of that shoe coming, so it should be here soon. And then, hopefully, I know it's not going to happen this month, sadly. Hopefully, in December, I should have something big to, to, to review for you guys, something big. I will do a pickup video at the end of this month. I think I'm going to do that probably every month, just a pick up of all like the streetwear and I guess the sneakers I've picked up for that month and just do a quick little thing to tell you about them. Um, I would uh, recommend this shoe to anyone. Uh, I do think if you're thinking about a basketball shoe, absolutely get this. And uh, I hopefully be able to post. No, I won't. That's not going to come out. You know what? I'll have another post, another video to be posted up, hopefully, this weekend. This weekend, I should have a video. About Sunday, I'll have a video. And it won't be about sneakers or streetwear. It's just going to be something I really like. Also, I'm wearing new glasses. I usually don't wear glasses, but there's like two videos I have where I have glasses. Those glasses ended up breaking i have these glasses and then i should have a backup pair coming in soon so thank you guys for watching uh like share and subscribe do all that basic shit thank you for watching this video and also have a wonderful wonderful day